Good morning. Today is Halloween costume day for Mike and I. Um, the kids know what they want to be. Well, let me back up. So we don't do like a family as much as I'd love to do a family costume. I think they're adorable. We don't do them because my kids always want to be, Berkeley and Vaughn always want to be very different things. And I just want them to be what they want to be for Halloween. So Mike and I kind of created our own tradition that we've done the past few years. Whereas he goes into the costume shop spirit and he picks out what he wants me to wear. And then I go in and I pick out what I want him to wear. And we have to wear what the other one chose, no matter what it, what it is. Last year, I was Bob Ross riding a bear. Hey, Jen, who are you? I'm Bob Ross riding a bear. Yes, you are. <laughs> I give Mike um, creative points on this one. I genuinely know in my soul that no one else in my neighborhood is going to be Bob Ross riding a bear. Here's Mike. Hey Mike, who are you? My little puppy tiger, Juby. <laughs> he had to Google what sounds they make. Do you think it's gonna be better than Bob Ross writing a video? That one's hard. it's gonna be hard at the top, but I do think mine is gonna be celebrated online and through the nations as an accomplishment that only a husband could do for his wife. I love that. Yes. That was a good one. People, people will seek after me. <laughs> Consult with me for their Halloween needs from this day. Shared a painting that I had done and things just went crazy from there. Um, wow, uh, I honestly, I cannot thank Jen enough for what she has done for my little small business and for my family here. What's it taste like? Candy. What kind, is it like a certain candy or? I thought it kind of tastes like a sweet tart. Yeah. Sweet tart. That's what it is. The ones where it has like those other ones in it and it's a bag. Oh, sweet. What are those called? Sweeties? No, wait. Smarts? Smarties. Smarties. All right. Berkeley's interview today with mom at lunch. When Ber you're at lunch at school. Okay. In my school. We're monologuing. Go ahead. You're allowed to go and eat with your parents outside. Would you like to ask our friends in the internet a question? What do you mm -hmm. want to ask them? I'll put a question box. What is your favorite thing to do at school? You heard <laughs> it. What's y'all's favorite thing to do at school? Drop it in the box. And! And I'll say, and! <laughs> Attitude. <laughs> okay. And what do, what's your favorite kind of like thing to do at school? Like math or science? What's your favorite or... subject? Yeah. Sometimes I really do think I missed my calling as an elementary school teacher. I would have loved to teach, to teach. Okay, let's talk kids vitamins. When I first heard of Haya Vitamins, I went on their website to kind of do some research, obviously. And the first thing that caught my eye was that it is zero sugar. And I have never seen a kid's vitamin that's zero sugar. And it's not a gummy. So Dennis, I don't know if Dennis tells you this, but my dentist has always said the worst thing parents can do is give their kids gummy vitamins. They think they're doing what's right by their children, but it's wrecking havoc on their teeth. So that was a big one. Um, I, ha I saw a little chart. I'm going to share it on the next slide just to see how it stacks up compared to other vitamins. How are they sweetening it? That was my question. How does it taste like candy if there's no sugar? Monk fruit. And I know you guys have heard me talk about monk fruit, monk fruit before because it was in that keto cookie dough. So these more holistic foods are using monk fruit because it tastes delicious. Another thing that makes the high of vitamins different is there are zero preservatives. So vitamins, this is a whole nother topic, but in supplements in general, sometimes don't disclose everything they use. And sometimes they'll leave off preservatives. And they have to have preservatives because they have to sit on the store shelves for very long time because vitamins are something you take one a day right and they come in big containers so they gotta they gotta have they gotta preserve um these don't so you're gonna get this bottle whenever you get your first order but then after that your vitamins come every 30 days and this allows them to use fresh ingredients anyways since i do have a child that is sugar sensitive um i love that i don't have to give five to eight grams of sugar to a vitamin every day so they have an awesome deal going on right now it's 50 percent off your first order to try them so you can tap the link and it will automatically apply you can only have one vitamin a day. I love it. One vitamin a day. You can have one tomorrow morning. I love 
Oh Man, it looks funny and harmless, but that wine turned full on escalated into a temper tantrum. And then it was bedtime. People are not used to our new bedroom furniture. We've had that bedroom furniture since when we got married. So a decade and it's so big and chunky. And this looks like baby furniture. Like even Vaughn, when it first got here, he was like, why is there a baby bed in your room? Poor little love seat. We have chopped its legs off. Just kidding. We just unscrewed it, but we have put it in so many different areas of our house. I don't know where to put it now. The legs are off because it was in Berkeley's little bunk playroom and it was like a cute little floor couch. I think it's going to stay here. But now that we have bedroom furniture, Mike and my little workout station is just bugging me. Like I don't want it. I want to put it in the guest bedroom. This is like, Mike makes fun of me. This is like an ab crunch machine. <laughs> and then this is pointless ab machine tutorial so you get on it like this ready oh, it's stuck <laughs> mike's like it's literally doing nothing how can you say it's doing nothing i like get cranking and then i hold it at the top and like squeeze i mean i get really sore after i do it i just haven't linked it because if i'm linking it has to be perfect and it's it gets like stuck and stuff what? What are you doing in here? I did. What are you making in here? I don't know. I'm making nothing. Oh my goodness. That's a What's so yummy? I think it's a mess. I see that. It's okay. Are you going to help me pick it up? No, I don't want to. I just want to stay. Rendering where the bar is going to be. You can see the chandelier. So that's going to be the frame. So I've told you all the debate we've been having with Vaughn is he wants to be something scary. And we're like, no, no. <laughs> and so I was at the Halloween store getting Mike's Halloween costume. And I saw this and I was like, okay, kind of weird and creepy, but not like morbid and, you know, blood and guts. And come to find out it's from like, it's from The Purge, which... I don't know what that movie is, but apparently it's like a horror film. Kind of deets. I love this sweater. It kind of tricks you because it's, number one, it's oversized. I'm wearing an extra small, so just to show you like how big it is. I love that the neck, I know a lot of people like kind of the over the shoulder look, and I just don't. I don't know why. I just feel like I'm a mom and I have like a toddler hanging on me, so I don't want like my bra exposed or my shoulder hanging out. So I do love that it is stretchy and it's comfortable. Sorry. Um, and you could do that. Maybe it's also because I wear really ugly bras. Anyways, here is the length. Y'all ready? <laughs> here is the length on this bad boy. I mean, it could be like a cute sweater dress. Like it's longer than my, it's longer than my shorts I'm wearing. So, but don't worry because it does fit like tighter around this. So like I can tuck it in if I want to. Usually I don't and it just clings to like my hips. So it's great. It clings where you want a little bit of figure, but then it's super baggy everywhere else. <laughs> Too late. Oh, uh, is it too short? <laughs> you can see your mouth and chin. <laughs> Turn it around, see if maybe it's longer on the other side. Oh, I think it is. Oh, I'm eating pumpkin. I can't go that way. Oh, what if it's longer on this side over here? Great. That's better. 100% better. Yes, you could just, well, you'll have to cut the face right, but it's great. <laughs> Cute. Too low or no? Mm -mm. I think it's per, uh, you gotta tilt the head up. Perfect. Right there. You can't see my chin? Not when you don't talk. Mm-mm.